Hey guys, this is Fimir91. And let me just say, I'm not the one, this isn't a rumor or anything. This is a, I'm, I'm not going to say prediction, but apparently Dr. Sek, Sark, Sarkin, Sek, Sarkin, I'm not sure if I'm not that name right, Toto of Canton Games, who apparently is an analyst, at least based on the title saying predicted by analysts at GameSpot. And apparently during an interview with GL.biz, it's Dr. Sarkin, Dr. Sarkin Toto, so I'm just going to say Toto from now on. Toto, apparently, one of the things he said was, not all studios have hiked prices to keep up with the rise of production and other costs in game development so far, but gamers are likely to see prices go up across the board in 2023. He went on to say, I believe this trend will not only affect individual AAA titles, but also subscriptions and hardware, especially for Microsoft. So here's the thing. I'm not saying I know for sure, but I would, I would at least more be willing to believe that actual physical hardware like games I know that PlayStation 5 has already gotten more expensive in certain countries other than the US, but like actual physical hardware like games is getting more expensive. But I really don't think the subscription services, especially Xbox Game Pass, I really don't think Xbox Game Pass is gonna become more expensive. Why? Because, listen, I don't own a streaming service or anything like that, but I just think that it doesn't really cost much more to run them. Like just because like um, if games or the cost of making games go up, I don't think it costs much more to actually run the subscription service though. I don't know what their deal is, how much like, money or commission or whether it is even commission for putting your game on game pass but i just don't think that it really cost them any more money even if the cost of making the games go up i don't think it costs them much more money to run the subscription service because i think it probably costs them like around the same whether they have a million subscribers or 10 million so as long as they have a bunch of subscribers which i think they would get more of if the price of games went up but xbox game pass stayed the same I think they would actually get more subscribers because then people would be like, well, I can't buy all these games. Let me just go to Game Pass where I can get a bunch of games. So I really don't agree with the person that Xbox Game Pass is going to go up, but maybe the actual games themselves and maybe the hardware. But what do you guys think? Do you guys think this year we will, ex we will experience some price hikes across the board for games? Or do you guys think that maybe just some, like maybe just the actual games themselves and maybe the subscription services like Game Pass will not actually go up? Let me know in the comments below. Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. And may God bless you all.